I'm in eastern Oklahoma as the sun is setting and the wind just above the ground is beginning to ramp up. That's going to ramp up to about 50 to 60 knots, about 500 meters to a kilometer above the ground. That's going to create extreme low level wind shear for developing supercells that are now beginning to develop just south of the Red River region and also a little bit north. Those storms are going to move off to the northeast into a strongly sheared environment and likely produce tornadoes. Low level shear is supposed to ramp up to about four to 500 meters squared per second squared. That's going to be more than sufficient for even a strong tornado threat. And even though we have a beautiful sunset, things are about to get crazy over the night tonight. It's going to be one of the most dangerous types of severe weather events, fast moving storms, strong tornado potential, and they'll be uh, overnight tonight through early tomorrow morning. Eventually, these storms are going to push through eastern Oklahoma into western Arkansas and eventually into central Arkansas. And that squall line is going to continue east all the way through the lower Mississippi River Valley through tomorrow. But tonight is going to be the most dangerous part of this multi-day severe weather event with strong tornado potential across far northeastern Texas, eastern Oklahoma, and Arkansas overnight tonight. Westerlies! Big Westerlies! RFD coming!